From Ashable, I'm Adam Falk. A new study by J.D. Power & Associates shows drivers are more willing than ever to take the driving out of driving. The study asked whether drivers would let their car handle the speed control, emergency braking, and steering in bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic or other boring driving conditions. Of the more than 14,000 respondents, one in five definitely would or probably would buy a car with an autonomous driving capability, even if the feature tacked three grand onto the price tag. Individual features like stop assist and speed limit assist have even higher levels of interest, even at $800 per feature. Men are more likely to want the latest tech in their cars, the study found. Universally, young drivers and premium car buyers were more interested as well. The tech is catching up to interest. As Mashable previously reported, Cadillac is working on a system called Super Cruise, which does everything the drivers in J.D. Power & Associates survey were looking for. And other hands-off features like autonomous parallel parking have been around in various Lexus models for a while now. But there are lots of questions left to answer before we're all out not driving. What standards will autonomous cars use to communicate? Who is liable if two cars on automatic run into each other? For the moment, only Nevada allows autonomous vehicles on its roads. For Mashable, I'm Adam Paul.